You know what, and, um, Coach Sosa, last time we talked to you about somebody passing away, it was the, the great Hector Camacho uh, Sr. Um, and just recently it was announced that another Puerto Rican fighter, uh, Hector Coco Sanchez, just got killed the other day, another Puerto Rican fighter. You're from Puerto Rico, man. What's going on there, man? The streets are just rough there. Is the economy, people just killing each other? No. Or has there always been violence and stuff in Puerto Rico? It's, it's always been violent, you know, but now it's just getting worse and worse with the economy the way it is. And, and you know, it's, it's, it's a damn shame that a beautiful island, and, 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 you know, it's a lot of good people, you know, and a lot, a lot of good people, but it's these knuckleheads down there that, you know, for whatever reason, they try to shoot each other over stupidity, drugs, you know, money, and, and, and they're killing each other. And if you're in the middle of all that stuff, you gonna get killed too, you know. But there's, you know, there's there's a lot more good people than, than these knuckleheads that come out in these uh, violent crimes, you know. Just like everything else, it's in a small island, so you see a lot more. It's right. only what it's only 100 by 35, you know, 3.7 million people. Right. Uh, but it's unfortunate, man, that, that down there right now, the way you know, I got still got a lot, a lot of family down there, and I talk to them and. and, and it's, you know, it's, they don't even come outside anymore like they used to, and right. you know, it's, it's just ridiculous how people have to live behind bars and you know, basically in their own home, right? Because they're scared of violence or people shooting or right. or going somewhere and getting caught in the middle of some knuckleheads killing each other, you know? Right. What? Uh, also, uh, just recently, this weekend, we saw a Gary Russell um, fight, and he won. It's pretty impressive. He dropped the guy. But he pretty much outpointed him, beat him every round. He still has a speed, but I think he hurt his hand just a tad bit. That's why he didn't get the knockout. Um, but afterwards, he called out another Puerto Rican fighter, Juan Ma Lopez, wants to fight him at 128 pounds. How do you think that fight will play out? Yeah. Gary Russell versus Juan Ma Lopez. Woman just getting back, he just fought not too long ago. He didn't look that good. I mean, he looked very, he's struggling. But, you know, people were booing him back. You know, they fought in Puerto Rico. Mm -hmm. yeah, a lot of people didn't like. He didn't look you know, good. They didn't look, he didn't look at all. You know, very good at all. And, and people were born now. You know, and, and even though his first fight back from uh, from his loss, he's you know losing his title, or actually in the rematch, but he still didn't look well. You know, good at all. And I don't know what that was wrong with the kid now, man. You know, it might be mental. You might be going through some. You know, just you know being rusty and everything. But if they were if they were to, you know to fight now. There's, you know, Russell would, would, would definitely beat him. take, would beat him with the speed and and movement that he has, you know. He should be an easy fight for, for Russell the way Juan was fighting right now. Got you.